Hi, I'm reading from John chapter 16, verse 25 to 33. I have said these things to you in a figure of speech. The hour is coming when I will no longer speak to you in figure of speech, but I will tell you plainly about the Father. And that day you will ask in my name, I would, and, and I do not say to you that I will ask the Father on your behalf, for the Father self loves you, because you have loved me and you have been believed that I came from God. I came from the Father and have come into the world. I now I am leaving the world and going to the Father. The disciples said, Ah, now you are speaking plainly and not using figurative speech. Now we know that you know all things and do not need anyone to question you. That is why we believe that you came from God. Jesus answered them, Do you now believe? Behold, the hour is coming, indeed it has come, when you be scattered each to your his own home, and I will leave you, and will leave me alone. Yes, I am not alone, for the Father is with me. I say these things to you, that in me you may not you may have peace. And the in this in the world you will have tribulation, but take heart, I will come the world. <laughs> no matter what you are going through, God is there for you. Because he has conquered death. He has conquered the devil. There's nothing in this world that you need to be afraid of. No matter what you are going through, God will bring you through it. God has overcome everything. Just lean on him, trust in him, and he will give you great strength. Don't worry about the governments. Don't worry about the president who is in charge. God's the ultimate in charge. And we, we need to pray that the leaders come to know Jesus Christ. That he will lead those leaders. He will bring the ultimate justice to your life. No matter what, people might get away with things in this life. But sooner or later, those people will have to stand for God. And they will get the ultimate justice. So keep keep looking up, keep trusting God, and keep 